Uh, hello, everyone. How are you today? I'm Svetlana, and I'm really happy to welcome all of you on behalf of the Russian house in Kuala Lumpur. And uh, let me remind you that the former name of our organization is the Russian Center for Science and Culture in Kuala Lumpur. And every single day, we try to share with you information about the Russian culture and art, science and education, and of course, about the traditions of the peoples of Russia. And uh, more than 150 large peoples and small ethnic groups live in Russia. Uh, to live together, to live in peace, uh, to try to understand each other is uh, the norm of our life. Malaysian society is multinational society too. And uh, we can see uh, people's uh, respectful attitude to holidays and the uh, significant dates of other people. And uh, today we would like to take part in the preparation for the Deepavali festival. And thanks to my colleagues from India, rep representatives of uh, New Delhi, Mumbai, Calcutta, Trivandrum, and Chennai will be among the audience today. And of course, the key person of the floral, floral webinar is florist from Russia, Varvara Chikina. Varvara, please, uh, the floor is yours. Let's get started. Okay. Hello everyone, I'm very happy to uh, welcome you for our day webinar dedicated to the Deepavali Festival, which is we also celebrating in Malaysia. So what is Deepavali? As you may all know, this is the festival when we celebrate all good, the film of all good over the evil. This is the time of celebrating what we call it the light festival. And it's celebrated normally with festive lights, with fireworks, the sweet delicacies and family gatherings, which we've been waiting for so quite long here in Malaysia. You could also see uh, around the city, big shopping malls and offices, there are a decoration. So a uh, name, so named Ran Koli, decoration which is to put on the floor using the ground rice of bright colors. And normally you could see some uh, patterns and designs remind you of peacock, the bird, the national uh, symbol of India. We really love these patterns and designs. I think they're very, really, very, really, very interesting and colorful and really very authentic. And uh, the peacock here, of course, uh, became my inspiration for this webinar. I'm planning to make a flower bouquet in the colors of the peacock here. So that looks like that. I will be also using this as a detail of uh, my style, my design, okay design. So you could see that many people keep peacock here at home. Why? Because they believe that peacock here uh, brings prosperity and good luck. So I believe in that and I wish all of you uh, on the, the threshold of the Deepa Valley celebration good luck and prosperity to all your families, friends, and loved ones. So shall we start? I will just do a demonstration, not giving much comments, but if you have some questions, please, you can leave them in the chat section and we will reply them later on after the webinar, maybe after I'm done, if we have so. Thank you so much, so I shall start. I will be working with Hydrangea today. Uh, with, uh, this is Liz Yankos. Uh, with some greens, these bright colorful green will be the main color for us. This is just some dry flowers I want to use because they remind me of peacock uh, here, uh, fibers, textures, and I will be using this to type as well this. Some tinted leaves in the deep green color. And this is the Vanda Ochi, just for contrasting, um, like coordinating with this dark uh, spot, blue, bluish, dark blue uh, spot in the middle.
Just relax the heels, I think. Let's see whether this one is going to work for us or no. Just put it aside.
As you may know, that originally the you know, beer is uh, very decent. Uh, and I was thinking to add just small shiny details uh, to the bouquet to make it more festive look. Yeah, I'm going to use uh, this is just a bubble for um, uh, Christmas decoration. But I believe that's going to be quite interesting extent uh, for the bouquet. And maybe maybe something like that to the roses. I think that that's very beautiful already. What do you think? Um, okay, I'll just add one more. Bobo. So that will also coordinate that the front, uh, front eyes in the here. Okay, so that's pretty done. I still have to do uh, the kitchen wrapping, so let me tie this up. So it's like that. I'm just going to add some Okay, let's go to the shopkeeper. Uh, also in tone green paper. Thank you. 
Okay, so and I have one more piece to put to the front, and then I put the report. I have the gold one for the day, just to highlight the festiveness of the occasion. Oh, um, here you are. This is our Diwali bouquet. You can present to your relatives, family members, your loved ones to celebrate a special occasion. I hope you find this design interesting <laughs> and really nice. So I'm, I'm quite happy with uh, what it became. I think it's that it looks quite good. What do you do? Let us know. Varvara, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Very beautiful bouquet. And of course, I promise you, I promise to all of our audience, I will find the best place in the Russian house in Kuala Lumpur for this bouquet. And of course, we will celebrate uh, the Deepavali festival together. And uh, let me wish uh, to all of you a uh, happy Deepavali, Deepavali festival. Thank you. Join us. See you again. Goodbye. Thank you. Happy Deepavali. Bye.